Uzbekistan celebrated 25 years of independence, but festivities were subdued as Uzbeks awaited news about their ailing leader. Some attended a carnival in Tashkent on September 1st, marking the day the country declared its independence as the Soviet Union collapsed in 1991. President Islam Karimov was reportedly hospitalized on August 28th. One of his daughters wrote via social media that the 78-year-old leader was still alive and could recover from what she said was a brain hemorrhage. Prior to his illness, Karimov was scheduled to appear at a grandiose Independence Day concert in Tashkent. But the concert was cancelled and other events were scaled back. Late on August 31st, an Uzbek state TV announcer read out an Independence Day speech attributed to Karimov. 